umpire in this third quarter as uh, well not a good uh, ball up Herman's get the best of it picked up Douglas handball not to advance Luke Forbes dispossessed by uh, Murphy whistle on oh, play umpire. and uh, well he didn't have much opportunity no. and uh, Forbes gets the free kick finds uh, Jackson McLeod leading strong towards half forward Long kick inside forward 50, but a bad uh, one. I think Hayden Forms had uh, forgotten where he was, and uh, his opponent led him by 25 metres to the ball. So season decides to go uh, out of side here at Godfrey Street, and that's a great kick because he finds McClure on his own. McClure, handball out wide. And uh, certainly Winch are uh, trying to uh, get some sort of system as the ball goes to centre wing. And uh, this fellow's been good today. Higgins takes another mark for Winchelsea. Huge kick towards half forward. Uh, Atkinson tries to get the ball to ground. He uh, can't control it. Murphy tries to pick it up. But off their hands, it's over the boundary line for a ball in. He did the right thing, Murphy. He didn't fly when he could have. He waited for the big boys to get it to ground. But the boundary line... Uh, from the ball in here, Mench has come out from the goal square to do... Uh, the ruck work, ball comes clear. In fact, Mench ends up with the ball, handball back into uh, the middle of the ground. The player held it out the footy, it. and uh, that's Bonner for Winchelsea. Good call, umpire. <coughs> Probably had a good view of that by the same token. He died off a little bit in the second quarter, he Bonner, did. so he's got to come good with another first quarter performance. So uh, He likes it too. He thinks he can kick this. So Bonner now moves in. He's underneath the ball. It's going to be about the goal square. Big pack of Thompson players there. Ball comes to ground. Picking it up. Uh, did well, Davis, and uh, did very well to get it back anywhere near the goal square. But Ooh. We'll bring it back in now. Long kick outside 50, probably 65 metre kick. That one great kick underneath that, though, was Voss, and he was infringed, and we'll get the ball. So Voss with the ball. Been a turning point when he's gone into the middle of the ground. Instead of Forbes, his bigger body. Looking for options. Little chip kick up the wing. Ooh. Looks and finds uh, Walker there on the outer wing. He's a new fellow of the club. Girl, we haven't Ooh. seen him before. Don't be either. <coughs> this first quarter, his kick wasn't great. Butted up though and comes off the ground. There was Donald. He gets the ball knocked forward. Leak underneath it for Winchelsea. Goes in a big arc round wide to Season. Season straightens up in the middle of the ground. Not a great kick, but oh. it's going to find his mark there in uh, Higgins. And fairly influential, as Eric said. Right on the half forward line, kicks the ball long, looking for an over the top though of all players and Atkinson for Thompson will go back and butter up, over the top he goes, comes inside there looking for Thompson, he gets the ball now, delivers it over the top, comes out wide, running on there with Voss, couldn't take the ball with him, left it behind, off hands, in and under, big pack of players forming. Whipped out there by uh, Bonner it was. He's probably got one a little bit high. I'll tell saw you what, he saw it coming and ducked. Yeah, he ducked his head, and I suppose they're always 50-50, but I reckon if you duck your head, you don't get nothing for me. Comes off. Drives long there by Sawney, I think it might have been. Comes over hand. Oh. Yeah. Even though his legs just collapsed underneath him. <laughs> no, 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 he, he, he got, got a fair bump. Out. He got a bump, did he? I was looking yeah. at the... Uh, the only trouble was the ball was nowhere in the vicinity. Yeah, he was bumped out. The ball wasn't within five metres of that. It was just a bit too early. He actually ran into him, but he bumped him. 25 metres from goal, Mench will be when he kicks this. 45 degree angle for him should be absolutely no trouble. Comes in, kicks through the ball. Umpire does not move. That will be David Mench's fourth goal. So the ball goes up in the middle. Hermans and uh, Voss. Hermans perhaps the best of it, but uh, ground level. Luke Forbes went without it. Bonner, slow, low to the ground, kick it off. In fact, it was uh, Luke on that one, just near the 50-metre arc. As, uh, well, Bonner did the ruck work on that occasion. Ball comes to ground. Thompson working hard, get the ball to Voss. He's done well. Handball to Luke Forbes. He goes towards half forward. Normington outnumbered. Oh, oh, oh man. Bucks for Mark, bucks for Fortune. Yes, uh, the ball ends up in Hayden's form's hands, and he's uh, had a flying shot Spied out of it. bounds on the full. Winchelsea cross the face of goal. He loves doing that, doesn't Dangerous he? season has uh, made good for him. Decide to go back and, re, uh, and you know, repay the favour. Now McKenzie takes the mark and runs. That's better play. Out toward McClure. Unfortunately, it's a little too wide. And in right now. Out of side, Godfrey Street. Hermans gets the tap down. Straight to the feet of the players and bounces back into Herman's hands. He gets an up and under kick away. Forbes flies. Punch on play. Venables for Winchelsea. Can he get underneath and under that ball? No. Thompson will pick up, I think, via Jacker. Comes off hands. Back inside there it was, and it was uh, Smith for Thompson getting the ball out.
comes wide. Oh, here oh, he gets flattened with the ball. Play on, says the umpire. Smith back in there again. Can't get the ball out. Umpire's going to have to do something to whistle here. Sure, I get reported, but gee, they were good tackles. Mench flew for that, and the ruck gets the kick off fans and goes down to and finds Brody Donald deep in the pocket. He will have probably, uh, what, well, about 25, 30-degree angle, I suppose. He'd be uh, but only about 10 to 15 out. So it's on his right side for his kicking boot. So he'll come in. Brody Donald kicks through the ball. Umpire again does not move. That will be his second to the circle. Up we go. Good tap down by Hermans again. <coughs> Got over Voss on that occasion, but at ground level, picked up by uh, O'Donoghue for uh, Thompson. He finds uh, Jackson McLeod. Outside 50, the low skimming pass, and that's a great oh, pass. A great move. Look at that. <coughs> and, uh, well, as... Uh, Andrew just mentioned Hayden Forbes who hadn't taken the mark and the ball got through would have knocked his head off. Beautiful kick from McLeod. Now the all-important kick at goal. 40 metres out, almost on the boundary. And uh, I'll tell you what, he's uh, made good contact. Unfortunately, he hasn't got the right direction and uh, only uh, behind. First score for the quarter for Thompson. Set on. Oh! Simon Bayless kicks to himself and didn't actually then missed it. Well, he, dropped. he was lucky there was no full forward standing on the mark. It's gone forward. Hermans defends himself falling to the ground. Couldn't take the mark though as it fell. Comes off hands. Picked up by White. Uses Ooh. his pace. Burns him off. Goes forward looking for not finding anyone at home. McClure for Winchelsea will run back and will make... Quickly back into play again. Bayless. Play on. Kicks the ball up long. Looking for Dunkley. One out there uh, against Kados. But Dunkley comes up with the ball, gets a handball away, can't get it. O O'Donoghue comes up Good with the ball and delivers a great kick forward and finds Forbes. Hayden, opposite side of the ground to where he was a moment ago. Similar sort of kick, probably a little lesser angle. He's probably only got a 45 degree here. He needs to kick this for the team and for himself. Because he has missed a few. Hasn't wasted any time again. 45 degree angle, about 30 metres out. Oh, he hasn't done much with that one either. Hasn't made the distance. Yes, it has. This fella, not too sure where he's going, is he? No. He kicks to himself, and then he's basically kicked to uh, three on two. On the ground, too. <laughs> so the ball now at centre wing. Players diving in. That was Bonner diving in strongly. He can be in trouble here because he definitely did for the ball there. Was, uh, where's the umpire? No, no, no ball. No. ball here at Godfrey Street at the moment. Hermans gets a tap down. Bonner immediately tackled once the ball came near him. Does get it out, and that's good play. Now, umpire at least. Which is good for footy. So, Voss and Hermans both uh, hit the same way. Came down to Kados for Thompson. Towards half forward. Nobody can take the mark. Back of the pack. Hood hooks it. Oh, that's great. Either great vision or great luck because... Yeah, we'll call it great vision. Yeah, Hood. I think I heard... Uh, the. Young fellow Gardner calling and uh, on the left foot, he's now outside 50. It'll be a very good kick from young Gardner. Forbes looking for the handball. He was clear, but uh, Gardner has had a go. It's a magnificent oh, one. Handball. 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 So Brandon Gardner <laughs> comp bar north and bell post at the moment. Hermans will get the tap down, goes straight to feet, comes off hand there. Picked up by Kados, the fishmonger. He takes the ball out wide and finds Joel Irons out of sight of the ground. Irons drives the ball forward. McClure's going to be in the way. Comes over the top was Voss, though. Off hands, McLeod couldn't quite get the kick away. Then comes back up. Irons, butters up again. Comes to Voss's hand. He gets a handball away. Wadley gets the ball, turns it around, gives it to McKenzie. He goes round one, sells a bit of candy, all caught up this Ooh. time though, just got the ball away in time. Wadley again, oh, two, two Winchelsea players bumped into each other, the <coughs> second one was Bonner. He got the handball away, and the ball is going to run out of bounds, out of sight of the ground here at Godfrey Street. 13 and a half minutes gone. It's so intense, Grubby, two players from each side, like from their own side, are fighting for the footy. Yeah, they're bumping desperate. each other over and everything, but hey, who cares? That means it's great, that means they Absolutely. all want the footy. No faint hearts out there. So Forbes gone back into the ruck. Hermans again will uh, get that one down. Ball run through his leg. Leak shrugs off a tackle. Gets a handball away. Comes to Davis. Davis gets the ball away to Bonner. To Tornia. By hand then back to Davis. Drives the ball long. Oh, oh good solid oh. mark there by Murphy. <laughs> out of sight of the ground. Met some solid action there from Jacker. Great work by Murphy though. Murphy now for Winchelsea. Drives the ball long. Atkinson back to the play. Comes over the top. 
Uh, Dunkley running back there, and Forbes for Thompson will <laughs> clean up. Head kick for Normington. Normington gets the ball run through his feet. Handballs to his own advantage. Oh, oh, great, great tackle. Oh, great tackle. We got should, have been, should have been possibly rewarded. No, I don't think by so. Brody Donald. Luke Forbes has the ball. Sees the lead from McLeod. Oh, oh what hands. He's hurt McLeod. his leg, though. Yeah, I think he might have hurt, hurt his, his leg. He's hurt his knee here, which is really unfortunate for the Thompson side. Hopefully a knee injury, and it could be a nasty one. Let's hopefully it's just a knock. Hopefully, hope so. Over the top and late coming in was the Thompson player. It'll be a free kick to McClure. Permans picks up the ball and will get paid advantage. He drives the ball long looking for Mench. Two on one. Comes to ground. Venables underneath the ball but Atkinson cleans up. They go wide out there. Uh, real pace on there running for the ball out there was Irons. He's had a few kicks in this last five <coughs> minutes and the ball will go out of bounds. Didn't he's, look good, Grubby. No, he's gone straight off the ground. I tell you what, his hands just clamped around the footy yeah. too. He really wanted it and he's just starting to play well. And let's, he landed. Yeah, let's just hope it's a knock and it's a bit of a bruise and that's all because he's been terrific, Jackson McLeod. Back in. Uh, probably the better uh, half of the ball. It might have been Vossett who got that one out instead of uh, and half forward flank. Attacking in for the Winchelsea side. Handball away, looking for Venables. But Forbes again gets in the way. Comes off hands. Come back to Higgins. He drives the ball forward to one out contested Mench. Over the back came Atkinson. He gets the ball away. Forbes has got a lead in the race for the ball here. Forbes and Forbes, in fact. One shepherding the other. Oh, 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 that was great. Fantastic work by Davis, who took the two Forbes boys on. With Brad McKenzie, that he doesn't have to mind Jackson McLeod for a while. Yes, uh, maybe with Mench, he... Uh Pretty mobile up forward. He could be a, an option up there, but no the, doubt. the ball, oh, oh, the ball tackle, tackle surely and uh, <laughs> Sawney there goes goal. Which Mitch is in the goal. Touch. Oh, he tried to uh, shepherd it through, but uh, just touched through as uh, Grubby's men mentioned. Nine goals, seven sixty-one. Winch. They lead Thompson eight seven fifty. Don't get on our umpire's bandwagon, the, Mr. Yeah. Nichols. The, Gand the Gandhi cycle is for third quarter scoreboard, 17 minutes gone. The ball quickly into the middle. That's yeah. probably a... F it was there. Montgomery, Montgomery had well, no intention of going for the ball. But the umpire's point the wrong way. Oh, did he? Got the wrong way. So, uh, free so kick McKenzie, and he's found Tornia again. Pretty close to the boundary, but inside the, uh, the forward 50 arc. Hermans doesn't rate him to be able to kick the distance. He's sprinted down Thompson there. Thompson got one player inside. There is one. Oh, oh no, Brooks! So in the goal yeah. square, marked by Hermans, and uh, he's been threatening to take a big mark all day, I reckon, and uh, that was it. And he just goes back and pops his first goal for the day through. He's yeah. contesting. Oh, he's no doubt. Some at the base of the footy. Yeah, no doubt. I think the umpire has thrown that up and said, anyhow, up they go again and fly. Forbes probably got the best of that down, but uh, Hermans gets a second tap away. Sawney in under the ball. Came out to Venables to leak to Bonner. Bonner gets the ball over the top, almost handball to himself. Oh, a pack of players. Venables runs through. Says here. Bonner's got one high, and, and he will get the free kick right on the 50 mark. Because Bonner definitely slipped, but he was yeah. tackled high. Uh, oh, kick in, oh, bad well kick in forward, and Forbes has read that well, as Grubby said. And the kick will come back out on the outer side of the ground here, finding Gardner. Been good, this kid. Gardner in defence, kicks the ball forward, probably a little bit long there for his teammate. Boss is hot. He's a big, he's a big lump of a lad too, Partridge. He is. Ball comes in, Hermans gets all of that, goes forward, doing some heavy in and under work there again was Gardner. Can't come out with a ball. White tries to bring the ball out and pick it up off play. Off hands and right in front of our commentary position. Up she goes, Forbes. But again, Hermans. He's doing the better work against Forbes when Forbes goes into the ruck. Oh, I can't pick up the ball there. Was um, was uh, Brown comes off hands to uh, Winchelsea. Venables with the ball was going to oh, give. Was going to give. Had give nowhere it? to go. He should have given it off to uh, McKenzie. McKenzie. Yeah, yeah. He should have done it. To give straight away. First instance. Back in it comes. Looking for Hermans. Forbes is there underneath him. Oh, Ooh, took the tackle away. Well, he did that. Uh, did uh, Sawney. Saw it for the effort too, Sawney. Hermans gets the tap down. Forbes tries to take the ball away. Comes off hands. Hood wrestles through one, wrestles through two. Oh, Forbes gets wrapped up by a couple. Comes out there now to um, O'Donoghue. He tries to get the ball away. Luke Forbes really doing some hard work in and under here. Voss crashes through the play. Comes over the top with Shrimpton. Comes back again to Voss. Inside to Luke Forbes. Can he go around? Good shepherd given. Luke Forbes has one bounce. Runs to 50. Little short pass. Can it get there? Oh, one hand. Couldn't bring it to the ground. Was Warrington. Oh, great work by McKenzie, he comes out to the back finds Murphy, he's under pressure uses the boundary line and brings it all to see ball in, 
True centre wing in front of our broadcast position. Tapped down by Hermans. Picked up at ground. Well, nobody can pick it up. But White tries to get a handball out. Finally, uh, good work comes to White by hand. He gets the foot to the footy towards half forward for Thompson. Back there, Forbes, Luke. He can't get the footy. Well, he finally gets now the handball. Does. Now on the right foot goes. Goal! Oh, 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 the post. I reckon it just hit Bayless again. Still not too sure where to go. Go long, son. Get it out of the way. Now well, kicks to himself, again. and uh, I guess he's looking for a Herman. And, well, Herman's is one out against three, and that's a pretty big task. He's got to look at uh, better Good options work. than that, surely. But finally, the ball through uh, Gardner towards half four. Douglas eludes a tackle. Gets it out to Forbes, and, oh, he's uh, missed to the right-hand side. Hayden Forbes on this occasion. In fact, uh, Umpire said all. it uh, hit the behind post, so no score. So we'll have... It wasn't the behind post, Must maybe further on. in 20 <coughs> metres around. So, uh, ball tapped down. Players uh, can't get hold of it, except Susan. He uh, looks for the boundary. Luke Forbes picked it up. He's uh, dispossessed. Picked up for uh, Winch by Susan, who followed up. Now it's at centre wing. Higgins runs onto the footy. Gets a good shepherd there. Good work from uh, his teammate there. The long driving kick goes to Minch. Oh, almost. Uh, oh, oh, yeah. Beautiful handball, Minch. So uh, a, a Minch goal. Uh, oh, that's interesting because he absolutely got flat. Up. Up they fly. And it was uh, Curlin for Winch. Got one right into the mark. Comes off hands. Voss with the ball. He gets the resulting free kick and runs away looking for Normington. Oh, good mark. Solid mark there by Corey Normington. Uh, probably uh, 45 metres out of Eric. There's another uh, woman coming up, Val. <laughs> Val, there is another uh, woman coming up and waving to Eric. Uh, I tell you, you've got to get out of the footy, Val. Hey? <laughs> Norrington, <laughs> too much directly in front. He will kick from 50. It would be a good kick. Oh, oh kick through that cool. beautifully. <laughs> Do not worry about that one whatsoever. Corey Norrington. We've got Curlin, gets the tap down for Winch, <coughs> giving uh, the big fella a spell close to three-quarter time. The clearance goes to Winch. It's just outside forward 50, and uh, whistle on play. Umpire says stacks on the mill. I'll have it. As uh, the uh, ball comes to Curlin again. That's uh, three tap down in a row. Come to Montgomery for Thompson. Around the body. And as far as Tornier for Winch. Oh, where's he gone? Oh, kicked it straight to uh, Jackson McLeod. Yeah, test the leg. So, uh, well, he's landed awkwardly, but I tell you what, he's found Norman again. And, uh, That's beyond his distance. Well, it would be 60 metres from goal. It would be a huge kick from there. But I fa he fancies having a go. Well, I'm not quite sure on the ground this big that that 50 metres is actually 50. So he might only be 50 out. All right, fair comment. So Normington now. The kicker of the last goal for Thompson. He's given himself uh, every opportunity. It's going to land just short. Comes to ground. Picked up Jackson McLeod. He's hooked I'll off. I'll tell you what, he's got it. And Isn't uh, that good to see? Yeah, that was doing a really terrible job, but Herman's gone back in, and he will get most of that as Forbes just runs into him. Possibly something there for him. Comes off hands. And the bottom of the pack there was Montgomery. He's going to get, get the ball out. He's going to get this one out short. He's going to be in strife. It comes out by its own accord. Voss in underneath the ball. He can't get it out. Oh, God. up she goes again. Hermans. He will get the ball down. Montgomery loads him. Kicks the ball long. Looking for, uh, but not finding Normington. Comes off hands leading in the race for the ball was McClure for Winchelsea. <coughs> Tawny in now. Can he make most of it with his pace? Leading for the race out there. Little toe poke off the ground. Going to use the boundary line to his advantage, is he? Position. Hermans and Hayden Forbes. Hermans belts the ball further around the boundary line. Running onto the ball there was McFarlane. Couldn't take it all with him as the Thompson player. Imperted his process. He goes to ground. Oh, get in there. Up. That's a ball. I said it was a great broadcast. He must have just me tuned and he couldn't be listening to you two, Hobos. <laughs> Surely. <laughs> Little toe poke off Brown. Comes to Venables. He gets a handball away. Looking for Bonner, I think it was. He couldn't get the ball off. Comes out to Leak. He belts it forward. It's a two-on-one contest over the back. Oh. Minor score to the been down the uh, it has been. Tate has Street end, hasn't it? So the ball kicked in quickly for uh, Thompson. Voss punches the ball back, uh, hopefully to advantage, but there's a nest of winch players there. <coughs> Hermans went for the handball instead of the kick, does follow up. Can he pick the ball out of that uh, scrummage? No. It's a big, long handball. The umpire paid a mark. <laughs> <laughs> so the ball comes down white for Thompson. Well, could have been a... Decides to play quickly, looking for Mench. He's got three to beat. Oh, can't, can't get off the beat ground. That. 
has uh, the ball at the <laughs> no, true. So the ball deep in the uh, attacking area for Winchelsea. Mintz got the tap down to advantage. Ball comes clear, picked up by Davis. He gets around a couple of players, throws the ball, leak, dives forward, no free kick. Coming back, Luke Ford Great without the kick. footy. And finds a teammate in Smith. He uh, plays on quickly as the ball comes to Hayden Forbes. He look, doesn't look, just goes bang towards half forward as the siren sounds for three-quarter time here in our match of the day. And that... here in the final quarter as uh, Hermans gets a tap down for the Winchelsea side. They can't get the clearance until now. Luke, great work, gets a handball forward. Very McKenzie tough. was held but uh, no free kicks at the umpire. The ball uh, back through Sawney looking for McFarlane. His handball goes astray. Picked up for uh, Spelled. That's a Donald goes towards full oh, forward. No. Well, he can take the mark but it's a positive handball. Well, he's paid advantage and got a goal, so I think. So it was uh, Thompson's side against Hermans. You know that interview we had before the game with the interlude coach? He's just turned up now. Has <laughs> he? Oh, God. What's going that's on there? That's because he's, umpire, he's umpiring. Uh, he's paid a free kick to an infringement by a Winchelsea player over the line from the boundary Don't umpire. That. Gone to Voss. Voss kicks the ball long and finds Normington. Normington about 40 from goal, 45 degree angle. Um, he's proved that's within his range. Yeah, he has. He didn't do a lot early, Normington, but he's really willed himself into the game, hasn't he? Uh, so not a good error. So Forbes goes around the outside looking for another one. Give it to me, give it to me. It didn't work last time, and I don't think it's going to be needed this time. No, no. it's not. Normington no. will kick his second. Thompson. Go. Compared to you, <laughs> back in the middle we go. Oh, Forbes probably gets all of that down and comes to comes to Douglas, but off hands it comes to Bonner. Bonner for Winchelsea drives the ball forward. Mench tries to get the ball down, looks for a little bit of a free, couldn't, that wasn't given. Drive back by Hood, I think that might have been. Comes forward and Hermans will run back and Pretty take good the big fella. Yeah. Hermans, see in the inner league squad, Pricey. Set of the ground, Hermans. Drives the ball long, again to Mench, again two on one contest against him. Rave this time off hands was Davis, he swings the ball back, but running back into the last line of defence there was Smith. Smith brings the ball to the outer side of the ground looking for Voss, strong mark by Voss. Half back, defensive side for the Thompson club. Voss, encouragement coming from the Thompson bench to get on with it. He does that, he's brought it out wide, he's kicking it straight towards Herman. Don't kick it to the biggest bloke on the ground, surely. And the bloke against him was White, who's one of the smaller blokes on the ground. Hermans drives the ball forward. Three on one contest against Mench. Where are the Rovers this time? Not there. Voss comes up again with the ball. Can't get rid of it, get rid of it, son. He'll be pinged. Comes out of hands to Murphy. He gets a kick off the ground. It's rolling forward. Minus score. Scoreboard nearly four minute mark. The Last quick, call. <coughs> quick kick in came to Atkinson for Thompson. Around the wing, looking for a teammate out there. It's very, very close to the boundary. It's over. Over. carried over. So between half forward flank and centre wing. They've just become a bit predictable in the last five minutes. They go to Mitch with eight blokes on him. Try something else. Try something else. The good part, Winch at long last have had a couple of small blokes at uh, Mench's feet. Off the pack there came to uh, Luke. Oh, Bonner went without it. Certainly the handball was at his feet. But Luke recovers strongly. Comes to try to get the ball. Sawney can't get it out in that uh, scrimmage. Umpire... He's calling, ball up, he's up. calling play on but, uh, the ball. Oh, up, I said he? before the game, great to watch. So uh, Voss, big tap down and uh, accepts a handball in the follow-up. Handball to Hood, over the top to uh, Walker. Walker now goes goalwards. At the back is uh, McLeod. He's got two to beat. McKenzie picks it up for uh, Winchelsea. Handball. Get it back. Gets, oh, to, uh, gets a handball back. A good-looking kick towards the middle of the ground, but uh, just short of the mark. Walker oh. threw it out. Oh, reckon he threw that. The ball that like, comes to ground once again. Winch, oh, he picked it up, Bonner, and really uh, wasn't too sure where to go. McFarlane drops it. Gee, it's uh, very hard and tough in there at the present moment. Comes to the big fella in Hermans. He tries to get a handball forward. Comes out for Thompson to Smith. Smith towards half forward. McKenzie, good position. Coming back, McLeod made a contact. Good work for him. Holmes tries to pick the footy up for Winch. He goes down. I reckon he dropped it. Well, well he's played it the other way. The, uh, What's going on here? Players are going the other way. and the no, other no. Line, It's a free kick to Thompson back on half forward flank. Now the umpire's intervened, I think. So well, he paid it this bloke, and then he just let him keep going. 
He's, look, he's only a young kid. He's made a mistake, but he's got the decision right eventually. Well, the other one, the wrong way. Ordered the wrong way, and they played on, and he was going to let it. So the upshot of it is free kick uh, went to, uh, that looked like Gardner. He's found uh, Jackson McLeod, and McLeod, man on the mark, 35 metres from goal. So a bit of a, uh, a muddle there from the umpire, but it's been sorted out. Correct decision finally arisen, and McLeod, having kicked four already, could be a hero this afternoon because uh, at this point, the most important kick. McLeod now moves in. Good looking kick. Goal umpire goes a little bit across, but not too. Thompson, one point game. Up they go. Hermans gets the tap down. Then does the roving by himself. Comes off hands and he's got to do the tackling by himself as Voss got the ball away. It's a one out show. Ball comes back to Voss by hand. Then out to Hood on the outer side. No, that was not Hood. That was um, that plenty of time in a one point match. Up they go. Hermans gets the ball, knocked around the boundary line, picked up by Luke Forbes, goes around one, or does a bit of a Kevin Bartlett, throw the ball away, not pinged for it. Umpire says, throw the ball back in. A little bit lucky to get away with that one. A little bit of push and shove. Uh, that's going all right. on down there. Yeah, that's all right. By yeah, the Ruckman, who aren't in place for when the ball comes back well, in. That's not good. Forbes, <laughs> Forbes <laughs> runs around and will take the uh, result and tap in. Comes off hands. Ball comes to O'Donoghue. He drives the ball long, but going back there that's is season. Very, very terrific very down there. Very Don't very worry good. about that. Very strong in defence, and he comes to Bayless. Bayless brings the ball straight across the ground and finds McKenzie. He gives a little chip then. And the ball comes out and is found by McClure. McClure then comes into the centre of the ground. Mark taken there by Davis. Davis back to Susan who runs through the middle of the ground. Drives the ball long into attack. Looking for Mench. Goes to ground. Comes off hands there. Picked up by Jacker. Jacker with a kick. Goes back out to the outer side of the ground and finds Douglas. There's a little bit of a run on gap here for them if they keep moving the ball quickly. Chip kick to Voss. Centre of the ground now. Voss. He'll go back. Takes a bit of time. Finds the ball and goes out wide. Back to, uh, I think that was uh, O'Donoghue out there. Goes for the ball in the contest. Ball go Kick it out here somewhere. Just try something different once when you go into attack and see what happens because they really need a goal now. So nine and a half minutes in the quarter. Hermans gets the tap down, front of the pack. Finds McKenzie, round the body. Not a good kick. <coughs> Straight into the arms of... Uh, Jacker. Jacker it is, who's uh, come up from half back. He long kick into forward 50 and uh, Mark not taken. Comes off hands. Picked up there in the last line of defence there by Holmes. He gets the ball away by hand. Little kick. Then goes up the wing and finds Tornia. Tornia half back flank. Defence for Winchelsea. Needs to get the ball moving. Gives a little handball. Under pressure to season. Not the best kick in the world. Gets it away. Intercepted there by O'Donoghue. O'Donoghue brings the ball around the corner and finds McLeod. Driven forward, off hands. McKenzie will clean oh. up. Oh, spiralling barrel. Yeah. Interesting looking There's kick. No need for that though. You've got to there put the target out. There wasn't at all. McLeod, big give back to Luke Forbes. He's on the run again. Goes round one and two. He's going Dispossessed. To get a no. Out of bounds. Out of side of the ground. Half forward. Flat. Ball to a bloke who is under pressure. So ball comes back in. Herman's over the top. Again, the back. free kick. Free kick to Wall. Oh, no Murphy. advantage. No advantage. Free kick to Murphy. Rob Murphy. With the ball. Little chip kick up the outer wing. Forget the scores, Eric. This find is too interesting. <laughs> game. We'll find him over. Oh, Eric Bottas. If you've ever seen in your life. Comes to Davis for Winchelsea. Off hands. Gets the ball away. Oh, good flying mark there. Back in the last line of defence. I think that might be Jacker again. We'll find a sec for these, a moment for these scores in a minute. As the ball comes through. Wadley for leading in the race for the ball. But it's White for Thompson. He gets a little chip handball and chip oh, away. And solid mark by Normington. He's, He's really coming in the second half, this kid. He hasn't. Oh, that's good. Oh, mucking around. They're mucking around. Bit of yoga. Yeah, but once the player's got a mark, you can't touch him. I could well have played. I'm glad he didn't, but he could have. Just outside 50, Normington at the 40, or just beyond 45 metre mark. 45 degree, I should say. Outside 50 metres. He's going to wind up. Sends it out wide. Brings it back. Minor score. Eric, some scores. Kenzie's gone. He's off. <laughs> Three quarter time, other games. Anarchy, 11-4. Bannockburn, 11-12. 
North Geelong to no, the side. No, no, no way, no way. There's still a lot of footy left to be played there. Ball comes back in. It's the outer side of the ground now. Godfrey Street side picked up there by Jacker. Drives the ball forward. It's a two-on-one contest. No one marks it. Over the back, McLeod. McKenzie gets it. Breaks away. Could have a bounce. Doesn't. Gets a kick away. Looking for... Uh, and not finding Dunkley. Over the top, handball given to Higgins. Higgins gives it back then to uh, Dunkley. He drives the ball forward to a one-on-one -on -one this time for Mench, but he can't bring it to ground. Atkinson Tapping comes back and cleans back. And Atkinson... Oh! oh, 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 oh Stanley Matthews! So Got a top off a good day. When McKenzie gets the ball, he's got to chase him, injured leg or not, because that could hurt him. So oh. Shrimp, oh. the ball's come out and Shrimp and the ball did not dispose of the ball. Great tackle there from Comes Herman. off hands. There's him by 10 points, you beauty. Who cares? That's what we want to hear, Freddie. Herman's with the ball. He drives the ball long. <laughs> oh, what are you doing to me, Fred? I'm trying to call it game. Oh, what are you doing to me, Fred? Picked up both hands. It's, it's Dunkley with the ball. Kick, yeah. Whistle on play to Dunkley, is it? It's a whistle on play to Venables. Venables, I think. No, in uh, fact, it's our man Bonner. Bonner. It is He's come Bonner. back into the second half of this game. Very good first quarter and was a little bit quiet through the middle part of the game, but he has come back into it in this last quarter. He is right on the boundary line. Oh, wouldn't it be a team lifter to kick it from there? A little kick from 40. Big, deep breath from young Bonner as he comes in. Sends the ball on its way. Is it going to come back? Probably not. Oh, oh, great mark. oh, Higgins. Great mark by Higgins right in the top of the goal square. Good kick by Bonner. Higgins should go back and pop this through. It will be his second goal if he does. And a seven-point break to the Winchelsea side. Where are we, Eric? We're just approaching the 15-minute mark. So Higgins comes in. Top of the square. Kicks through it. He has sent that all the way into St. Margaret's, if you don't mind. And they will go. So ball cleared in the middle by Luke after a tap down from Hermans. Winchelsea pretty hard at it there. And... Uh, Good work by Davis. Runs Here forward. Go. He's gone with the goal scoop. One on one. Mench at the back. Ball falls to uh, Donald. He can't get to the drop of the footy. He does well. Follows it up, unfortunately. One on one. You're still going to be able to jump an inch and a half off the ground. And Mench, yeah. you just can't do that at the minute. So, <laughs> that was an interesting tap down by Mench. Oh, the ball comes out. Gee, it's pretty hard and tough in the clutches in there at the uh, centre half forward. Winchell see, ball comes to Leek, he tries to elude a tackle, tries to get a handball out. Good work, Venables, he gets to the bottom of the tack and gets hold of the footy. It's going to be ball. Dog, ball. To, uh, Montgomery. Montgomery it is, towards half forward. Oh, McLeod had three to be the centre wing. About to come in, big pack of players at the drop of the footy. Hermans gets the tap down, clearly. Oh. Heavy bump on uh, Bonner. It was. I reckon he got him in the shoulder. Yeah, I don't think he got right. him in the head. I reckon he played for that. Played the umpire beautifully Bill, for that he, one. He did pretty well. It's, there's, oh, that's great positional football by Murphy. They settled, they? They they settled did the Murphy. Boots. Saw the player running into space there in Holmes. Holmes has taken a mark outside 50. Wouldn't think he could kick the distance. That, he's given a pretty decent burst. Oh, that's a free kick over. Tony up. Surely. No, anyway. Sends the ball back up. Hermans has done well all day. Forbes gets that one down, but Leek roves to him. Kicks the ball forward, but back into defence there is Jacker. He goes down the out outside. Brings the ball out wide, looking for and uh, finding Walker. Walker, little chip kick up the wing, will find White. White right in front of the broadcast position here. Kicks the ball oh, right. It's a little bit over the top, and Wadley's going to get a break for the Blues, and here they come again. Go forward. Big mark up over the top. Oh, good defensive punch away there. Picked up by O'Donoghue. Gives to White. Little bounce and run. Get some run forward. Looking forward over two on one. Oh, mark. Oh, solid mark there. Back comes Holmes. Holmes, centre half back. True centre half back position. Dunkley on his own on the wing. He's going to settle it down now. Little chip kick inside. Oh, puts his teammate under pressure in uh, Davis. Gives to Leek, though. Leek kicks the ball forward at any cost. Oh, strong mark. Leek's bonus is the fact that he can get the ball to boot quick. Very, very quickly. And, if he, and I've noticed him today. If he can't sort of pick it up, he digs a boot into it, gets him an extra 20 metres. He'll get him everything he can. I love watching him play, but as I said before, the game, I'd hate to play a little mongrel, I tell you. <laughs> ball with Brody Donald. 45-degree angle will kick from just about 50. 
for Winchelsea. Oh, oh, Price's is goal. Paul Price's goal. Paul Price. Ooh, Sorry, well, you can't sit in this well, box if you're not going to be a junior. Well, you're sacked. Stu, you come out the same <laughs> way. <laughs> Montgomery get the, kick the ball back in and drive it along by Thompson now, looking for White on the centre wing. Here they go. go. Coast to coast break. Come on, my son. One's bounced by White, runs into an open goal. He's, He's got there. it. He's got it. Jared White's first, and they will go. Yeah, umpire puts the ball in the air. Hermans gets a tap down, and uh, as he's done many oh, times, hey, Luke, he's been the last five. Luke again gets the uh, clearance. Oh, Jacker, he's great saving well, mark at the uh, at the back half for uh, the Thompson side. Goes towards centre wing, turning it. Good use of the body, and all white. Can't do that, unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> Forbes and Hermans comes down to Sawney. He's uh, well, he's pinged for dropping well, the ball. I'll tell you what, there was not one half a second of prior opportunity no. there at all. Poor decision, that one. I didn't like that one, but they've done a very good job today. So, ball now through uh, oh, Walker. He's put not a good bad kick spot. to the he's, middle of the ground. He's very proppy, Walker. So, uh, ball now comes out to Hood. He can't control. Again, players, well, they're, whoa, they're pretty hard again. Forbes over the top. Tornier, tackle without it. He can't get rid of the footy. As uh, Well, nobody can get the footy. There's a tap out. Good work, Winchelsea. They get the uh, breakthrough. And, uh, gee, uh, Venables, is it? Venables, is it? Venables, it is. He's going to be pinged again. They couldn't Don't be him this time, for God's sake. Yeah. Oh, the wrong bloke in charge at the present moment because uh, it's pretty hard and tough out there. In the middle, it's Luke. Picks up the loose ball. Four winch. Goes towards full forward. Donald, good work. Punches it towards the goal area. If McFarlane's not enough pace, kick off the ground. He can't pick it up. And it's rushed through Great for defense. another behind. 14-12, 96 winch. 13-9, Thompson. Smith, Holden, Blood, Suzuki. Final quarter scoreboard. We're past 23 minutes. Well, I think it's troubles up to take the ruck contest so it'll be Mench comes off hands it was against Shrimpton Bonner comes up with the ball oh, oh, good, good little play. kick chip, kick and great vision there and he's found Joel Higgins directly in front of goal 50 he's going to kick from at least 50 just outside of 50 you would suggest if they, if they win this they could nearly be the match winner this bloke He's done very well, hasn't well, he? No doubt. And I'll tell you what, the bloke that give it to him there isn't <laughs> far behind him with Bonner. He's played a ripper as well. So, Higgins with the ball. He's going to kick from outside 50. It will be a very, very good kick for goal from there. 24-minute mark here in the last quarter. Runs in. Kicks the ball truly. I tell you what, the goal umpire has not moved an iota. That will be Gibson here as uh, Herman's again. 50-50 tap down. Sawney. Didn't perhaps go as hard as he should have into that flat ball, but Lux of Fortune came into his hands, picked up Bonner to Luke, and those two have been sensational today. Towards half forward, McFarlane, good contest there. O'Donoghue, oh, put it behind Jacker and set him in front of him. Oh, 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 Improved. Oh, and he nice chase by Tornia. Oh, and Umpire believes he handballed it. He thought he must have got rid of it. It was, it was nip and tuck, but gee, tough. So... Boss actually, no, I thought the free yeah. kick had to go to Jacker. It comes back to him now. <coughs> Jacker chips it out wide. Players loose for Thompson, but Winchelsea, they've manned up one-on-one, -on -one, and that's what they uh, certainly need to do. It's going to have to come back to Jacker in the middle. Tornia right there. They come out wide, looking for and finding Smith. He uh, over the top to Hood. Hood now, little chip pass. They've got to go more direct. It's in the arms of Walker, but they've got to get it to the goal square. Time of the essence. Nearly 26 minutes now as the ball goes towards uh, full forward. Coming across his homes again. Not going to kick it down there. Handballs and uh, good work, Venables. Slip. Ball comes back in. Deep in Thompson's forward line. They need to make something of it. Comes off hands. Voss comes up with the ball. Can't get a clean possession away. Leek takes on one. Dispossessed. Umpire says play on. Fall on it. With the Tommy Tigers. Up it goes. Herman with the ball. Taps it to Leek. Little oh, underground kick. Up on after he kicked it. Worked the boundary line. Yeah. It was a bit of a late call by the umpire, but a correct one. I think he might have staged a little bit too, the little fella. <laughs> Comes to Venables. Venables for the Blues goes forward looking for Mench. Two on one contest as it's been all afternoon. Davis can't run onto the ball. Picked up though by Thompson. Jacker again. He'll drive the ball forward and a mark will be taken right in front of the commentary position by Hayden Forbes. He drives the ball long. It's going to go over the top of McLeod's head. He can't get the ball to, bop, to drop. Normington. McKenzie then for Winchelsea. Picks the ball up. Oh, that's a rough old kick. I tell you what, that's out of bounds. Not a good kick. Oh, 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 right work. McFarlane intercepted the pass. 
Oh, a bold move back into the corridor. 20, at the stage 25 of... metres he ran to intercept that. That yeah. beautiful reading of the play. And he found Tawny at centre-half back. Now he's got to go wide. That's what he does, right across the ground. The uh, Oh, oh Higgins again. Who else? Who else? Great mark, centre of the ground. Now you can slow it down, son. Where's he from, Pricey? 27 and a half oh, minutes okay. gone in the quarter. Now chips it to uh, into the middle. Just retaining possession. Bayless chips it out wide. Higgins or oh, teammate yeah. out there. Yeah, they got McFarlane. Yeah. McFarlane, I think they can sense it, the winch boys. He's got a black Eddie all on his own. But it's across the ground. Now they've decided to go back to McKenzie. Now McKenzie hasn't used the ball all that well. He's been blazing a bit. That's better. Control pass. Back to Higgins. Centre of the ground. And this is very frustrating for Thompson. Well, because we've got to just holding the, the footy. Exactly right. As soon as it happens, you go man on man. Exactly right. Right, Higgins now decides to go along. It's pretty up. high. It's uh, towards half forward. Ball uh, in the contest comes to ground. Davis with strength picks the footy up. Handball over to McClure. McClure, oh, he gave the big fella a task there, Hermans, but he gets the foot to the footy deep into the forward line. Well, Donald well, just lets it go. Brings the ball back into play now, the umpire. Mitch gets the tap over the top of his head underneath. That was... Uh, I think that might have been McFarlane in underneath that pack and the ump. Bring it out to the near side of the ground looking for McLeod. He flies and takes the mark. He hasn't given up yet, has he? He has not. Half-back position, Jackson McLeod. Oh, there he is now because that is the final siren. 15-12-102. The Winchelsea side to Thompson's got 13 goals.